Moffian syndrome uh, can affect vision? Yeah, well, Moffian syndrome, typically you see children who might be very tall, long fingers. There's something, there's some disruption in the elastic um, tissue uh, in the fibrillin gene, which allow, which basically causes the child to have certain weakness in blood vessels. They, they might have um, elongated limbs, but it can affect the child's eyes. Uh, occasionally, Marfan's is, um, is seen in a hereditary pattern, but it, could, but it could also be sporadic. In the child's eyes, the most commonly um, affected structure is the lens. There are zonules which hold the lens centered in the child's eyes. These zonules can become very weak and the actual lens could be either subluxed or dislocated and it will actually float upward. If the lens does start to move, it can cause an astigmatism and can actually cause the child a loss of vision because he's not looking through the center of the lens. He might, the lens, he might be actually looking through the edge of the lens. If a child develops a dislocation of the lens in the eyes, sometimes it has to be surgically corrected. Um, these children are at a greater risk of developing a retinal detachment because of certain weaknesses in their eye. So Marfan syndrome patients have to be carefully monitored in terms of their um, ophthalmologic examination.